hello everyone in today's session we'll look into how to use for loop in a php now basically a for loop is a, a looping construct consisting of three statements first initialization second condition and third expression now a uh, syntax goes like this for provide some initial value followed by semicolon then your condition and third your expression and then within this block you can have your set of statements now for example assume I want to print hello world 10 times then I will use one counter let's consider i is the counter then initial value of i I will set it equal to 0 now I want to print hello world 10 times so instead of writing echo then hello world semicolon then again on next line echo same thing hello world semicolon instead of going this way what I can do I will simply use one loop I will use the I will use the loop something like this for initialization as I stated for consider three statement initialization condition and expression initialization I have done already only I have set i equal to 0 accepting but I need to give the condition over here condition is i less than 10 and then I will write dollar i plus plus then here I can use echo hello world now after that I want uh, the next hello world to be printed on the next line so I'll just given break statement so this is the basic uh, way of uh, using a for loop uh, let's consider a simple code for that the editor which I'm using uh, is the sublime editor you can use any of the editors so first I open the file and let me save this file by using uh, the name as for loop dot php anyways as the file is a php uh, extension of this file should be for loop itself and you save it now look over here my parent folder is php chap so we know I'm gonna to call upon uh, this file or gonna execute this file I need to uh, call upon by using the complete uh, name and the name will consist of the parent folder that is nothing but php chap all right so let me save this first let's check whether we can call upon this file so first you check whether you are local server is working yes it is working call why your php chap that is your parent folder yes now my parent folder consists of this file for loop dot php if i open this loop file it's completely it's blank nothing is written because if i look up on my code there's nothing in the code so let's start with the program so let's consider php and now let's go ahead with this i want to print uh, hello world 10 times so initial dollar i equal to 0 then let's use the for loop for initial value I may write dollar i equal to 0 but uh, again writing dollar i equal to 0 is senseless because already we have used that code so you can remove this we'll directly go with the condition dollar i or i less than 10 why I'm taking i less than 10 because my initial value of i is 0 and not 1 and after every iteration I want to increase i by 1 so I will say i plus plus and here let me say I write echo uh -oh. echo hello world and every time I want my hello world to be printed on next line so give the fact that's it save it and uh, recompile not recompile uh, refresh this page so you are getting hello world this many times now you want to also display you are not sure how many times it's printed also if you want you can uh, 
put that number also one hello world two hello world three hello world and so that for that purpose we just modify this echo statement so merge it by like this dollar echo dollar i because i is the counter now to we are merging strings so for merging we use doctor dot operator so it will go like this one hello world okay so what i do i put dot here also inside the bracket so that what will happen one dot then space hello world so i'm saving this and i refresh this page once again yes here it is coming but what's happening over here look at this initial value of i is zero because that's what the initial condition we gave it so in this case instead of saying zero hello world one hello world i want one two three four five like that so i'll just make a slight change and here instead of writing dollar i i will write dollar i plus one but uh, it should be in bracket let's save and refresh the page yeah here you get but uh, prior to this why i'm doing this so i should write one statement uh, just example of for loop so for that purpose what i will do i will give one another statement echo something wrong echo let me use h1 header program to check Uh, check a for loop. Let's consider All right, and I close this h1 tag I save and uh, Let me have one break statement as well or else what will happen that hello world will get printed there only at the end you provide semicolon because in PHP line terminates with semicolon I save this file and I will refresh this here it is program to check for loop so you are coming one two three four like this but if you are if you are trying to check the source code you won't get anything because php is a server side script so if i'm trying to check the source code you won't get anything look here you're just getting hello world hello world hello but it's not the one no? all right so if any questions if anybody have any questions you can uh, put in the comment and if you are like this then uh, just hit the like button and subscribe thank you